It's a new holiday celebration here in central Indiana this year. It's a merry prairie holiday <laughs> at Connor Prairie, and it all starts this weekend. Carlos yep. is there to give us an idea of what to expect. Hey, Carlos. Hey, Julia. Yeah, Connor Prairie's been around since the 1800s. They, they haven't had a public Christmas until this year, and, and then they invite Mrs. Claus here. Well, good morning. Good morning. How do you like your workshop here at Connor Prairie? Isn't it magnificent? Santa is so proud. <laughs> he, he's, he's loving it. And you can hear the music in the background. You have a little bit of a factory here. They're, they're making balls behind us up here in the top area. Let's bring in Christine DeJoy. Uh, so this is truly amazing because, like I said, it's the first year that you guys have done this. But it's more than just Christmas lights. Mm -hmm. What are we doing in this area? What's this area right here? Well, like you said, it's our first year for a Merry Prairie holiday. We're mm -hmm. very excited. And right now we're in the North Pole workshop. So okay. this is where Santa's elves are hard at work making the gifts for Christmas and trying to get everything ready just in time but for the But what, what is it for the people who are coming here? So for the people who are coming here, the parents can kind of come, have a refreshment, sit down off to the side. And then also the children can have a make and take that they'll make here in this building and get it wrapped by elves. And it'll be brought back down ready to go home. So you can see right now we're showing uh, some of the great things that you can see when you come here. So what are the dates of a Merry Prairie holiday? Well, our festival starts November 29th, which is Black Friday, and mm -hmm. runs through December 29th. So it's Friday through Sundays from 6 p.m. to 10 p.m. And then on Tuesday, December 31st for New Year's Eve, we're open from 6 to 10 p.m. with special fireworks at 9.30 p.m. for the family. That's awesome. Guys, it's the first year. And by the way, everything here at Connor Prairie is the 1800s. So, Kelly, what would you like for Christmas um, in the 1800s, what would you want for Christmas? Okay, I watched Little House in the Prairie when I was a kid, so I would say the slate board mm -hmm. and the slate pencil. That's what I would like. <laughs> Very specific. Slate yes. board and slate pencil. Okay, so what is a slate board and slate pencil? Oh my, every girl needs one for school. Yeah. She'll be ready. It's a black slate with white chalk. Okay. And, and she will be ready to be a fine student. And has Kelly been a good girl today? Oh, I understand Kelly's at the top of the list. <laughs> oh, <laughs> I'll take that. Guys. Kelly, good job. <laughs> good job. Nice, Kelly. Thank good. You. Congrats Thanks. to you. Congrats. You've been good. Very good. nice. Thank you so much. Well, a merry prairie holiday at Connor Prairie. Carlos has been live there all morning, and he's got a very special guest with him this morning. What's going on? Yes. Well, you know, when you're at the North Pole, you know, you got to see Santa or Mrs. Claus. And I'm here with Mrs. Claus at Connor Prairie. By the way, where is Santa? Well, you know he's busy. Of course. He's having dinner and breakfast with the children. Oh, I see. At okay. the Welcome okay. Center. Hey, you're not, you're, you, you are just as great as Santa. I want you to know that. Oh, he's, I'm his biggest fan. <laughs> Let's talk to Christine DeJoy here from Connor Prairie. This is the first year that Connor Prairie has celebrated Christmas? It is, and to the extent that we are now finally doing what everybody in Hamilton County had wanted us to do for so long. <laughs> and you got the lights back here, so where did you guys get all these lights? So the lights behind us, those are for donations from the Reynolds family. So mm -hmm. these are the famous Reynolds lights that were on State Road 37 since the early 90s. They donated them to us this past summer, and now they're part of a Merry Prairie holiday here as and, well. And that's not the only thing you have here outside yeah. you have a care, other things as well we have a lot of other things for families to do we have a vintage carousel down in the symphony bowl shell mm -hmm. we have a winterland wagon ride where you can go in a wagon and drive through lighted structures throughout our grounds and then we have inside our welcome center there's a couple of fun things to do as well we have um prayer or i'm sorry kind of prairie by candlelight That's that awesome. used to be here for years is now in prairie town in an expanded capacity and real quick what time does this all start what, what days this all start november 29th through okay. december 29th 6 to 10 p.m the 31st from 6 to 10 p.m. but fireworks at 9 30. Okay so uh, this starts this Saturday. Mrs. Claus so you actually uh, Kelly actually wanted something this you got something yeah Kelly's gift for Kelly, already. your slate and your soapstone you're ready. Okay and so Ben what do you want for for Christmas in the 1800s? All right here we go I'm taking a trip back in time I need a bow and arrow I got to defend wow. my family I got to feed him Carlos. Give oh, me that bow okay. and arrow. Bow, a, a, <laughs> got it okay so Ben wants a bow and arrow. Oh no Carlos he'll put out his eye. <laughs> <laughs> well that's true. You shoot your eye out Ben. <laughs> that's right. <laughs> <laughs> Just like a Christmas story. Yeah. Learn from Ralphie. Thank you guys. All right, thank you. You're going to have to come up with something else. <laughs> All right, I'll think of something. All right, well, Merry Prairie Christmas at Connor Prairie. This seems so much yeah, fun. Yeah, I know. Carlos is out there live for us this morning meeting some very special guests. And apparently you're on the fence. You're not on the nice list, but hey, you're not on the naughty list either. <laughs> 
Well, I'm going to be making a gift for people now. Look, check this out. This is really cool. See, look up there. See the ball that comes down at the toy uh, b balloon division? There'll be a little ball that's going to come out of that hole at the top. See it? There it goes. And then it goes down and it goes into the Plinko area down there. And then it finally goes down to the very bottom where paint is applied. And you can actually see this entire process here in this workshop. Mrs. Claus joins yeah. us right now. And this is a great workshop. The kids can actually come and they're going to be sitting on your lap as well. Oh, yeah. Yes, they're coming to my house in the North Pole okay. and writing letters to Santa, of course. And I would love to read Twas the Night Before Christmas. It's such a beautiful book. <laughs> you can actually see the, the, uh, the ball. Once it goes down, it gets dried and then it goes up in this area. Christine DeJoy joins us right now. So this is great. You can actually meet mm -hmm. Mrs. Claus and have mm -hmm. some fun outside as well. Yeah, you go to Mrs. Claus's cabin, hang out with her for a little bit, and then right outside of it, you can participate in our midway game area. Then we have dry tubing sled as well. There's a lot of fun here to be had at a Merry Prairie holiday. It's amazing. And in this area right here, guys, there are 100 elves. See the elves hanging around? You can count how many elves there are, and they're hanging out. And then look at that th th through the uh, glass there. You can see there's Santa. There's your husband right there. He's working oh. with some of the other elves uh, and get, getting that ball ready to be delivered. It's a whole process. And as we go back to the studio, Julia, um, what did you want for Christmas from Mrs. Claus in the 1800s, mind you, because we are at Connor Prairie? All right. If it's in the 1800s, how about a bucket so that I could go mm -hmm. to the river and get my water and bring it uh -huh. out back to my cabin? She wants... Okay, she wants a bucket so she can go to the river, get the water, and bring it back to her cabin. Is that okay? Oh, yes. And okay. we'll even put some sparkles on it for her. <laughs> there wow. we go. A Perfect. Bucket for you, Julia. <laughs> it's a very merry uh, prairie Christmas that starts this Saturday here at Cotter Prairie. Back to you guys. It's a mouthful, but it looks like a lot of fun. Thank you.